Welcome to another edition of Jonathan Mayberry Answer Stuff. Uh, Paul Bosworth has the question for today. He asked how I became a horror writer and what inspired me. A um, couple of things. First, my grandmother, who was a wonderfully spooky old lady, I loved her to pieces, um, she was into a lot of the supernatural stuff. She, she told me a lot about the myths and legends of France, Germany, and Scotland, and also some of the, uh, the legends from Appalachia here in the United States. So I got to know a lot about the, the folkloric versions of monsters, the, the werewolves, ver vampires, and so on, and how different they were than the Hollywood version. And I really found that fascinating. Then uh, when I was in uh, seventh grade, my middle school librarian, uh, who was the secretary for a couple of clubs of professional writers, took me along to some of the meetings of these clubs. And there I got to meet people like Ray Bradbury, Richard Matheson, Harlan Ellison, uh, Gene Roddenberry, uh, Robert Block, Robert Sheckley, and so on. And they instilled in me a, fan you know, a really deep love of all sort of fantastical stories, but maybe with a slight bias toward horror. Um, for Christmas uh, one year, Ray Bradbury gave me a signed copy of Something Wicked This Way Comes, and Matheson gave me a first edition, 1954 edition, of I Am Legend. Uh, those were pretty incredible Christmas gifts. Also, both men, shortly before they died, were able to give me cover quotes that will be on the 10th anniversary uh, editions of my uh, Ghost Road Blues series. And uh, it'll be on Ghost Road Blues, Dead Man's Song, and Bad Moon Rising, which come out this year in special edition. So my love of horror goes back to my childhood, and it's been with me all along. And one little, little thing to add to that, a lot of people ask me why I like to write horror. And I actually don't write um, monster stories, so to speak. I write it in horror genre, but my stories are not about monsters. They're about people who fight monsters. And that's a pretty distinctive uh, and important difference for me. So, Paul, thanks for the good question. Guys, thanks for watching. Catch you all later.